big Snoop Dogg got a Madden lead. This team is off the hook and you don't really want none. But if you do, come and get some. See, tell your mama and tell your daddy. I tell the whole damn world it's Madden territory. Tell your mama and tell your daddy. I tell the whole damn world it's Madden territory. Come get some if you want some. But you ain't bad enough, so you can't take none. I'm Big Snoop Dogg, and I'm the only one. And when it comes to Madden, all y'all fools my sons. Ha <laughs> ha, bag a bulk me and watch you lose. Snoop Dogg is on the mic, I'm giving Madden blues. And if you choose to run up on me, you gon' get laid out so fast. Cause I can get you with the run, or I can hit you with the pass. Justin, I can't be schemed. Roll your when I'm in a mud league. Too old, too old. Madden time on you suckers. Well, y'all can't get close, so why you wanna touch us? Cause my team is so hard. My team is legit. Madden 20, Snoop Dogg is. I get it. I got cleats on my feet. Jersey on my back. Helmet on my hair. Ready to attack like that. Down in Mississippi and New Orleans. Big Snoop Dogg got a Madden lead. Your team is off the hook and you don't really want none. But if you do, come and get some. Me tell your mama and tell your daddy. I tell the whole damn world it's Madden territory. Tell your mama and tell your daddy. I tell the whole damn world it's Madden territory. Come get some if you want some. But you ain't bad enough, so you can't take none. I'm Big Snoop Dogg and I'm the only one. And when it comes to Madden, All y'all fools, my sons. <laughs> Bag up off me and watch you lose. Snoop Dogg is on the mic, I'm giving Madden blues. And if you choose to run up on me, you gon' get laid out so fast. Cause I can get you with the run or I can hit you with the pass. I can't be touched and I can't be schemed. Roll your when I'm in a mud league. Too old, too old. Madden time on you suckers. Y'all can't get close, so why you wanna touch us? Cause my team is so hard. My team is legit. Madden 20, Snoop Dogg is. Now get it. Big Snoop Dogg. It's in the game. Ladies and gentlemen, ladies and gentlemen, are you ready? Are you ready? Get ready, no.
rocket like rocket fuel. It's the young, incredible, honest, the unforgettable. You were Joe like Chappelle show. This so perennial. Do this for my millennials. I be murdering any flow. I just had to let you know. It's the young, incredible, honest, the unforgettable. You were Joe like Chappelle show. This so perennial. Do this for my millennials. I be murdering any flow. Yeah. I just had to let you know. Yeah. Uh, give me that work and I can sell it. Uh, I put it on the line like I ain't selfish. Nah. The story flip if I let you tell it. Put my heart and soul in so you feel it. I ain't never faking, I'm the realest. Tupac in the prison, man, claiming his innocence. Currently, I'm the greatest rapper in a sense. But any currency, I'm still guaranteed my wins. This is coming from within, I stuff for real, I don't pretend. When the OG spilling knowledge, bet it's best you soak it in. I'm a prophet to them scholars, got them chakras opening. Got them fixing up they actors, now they truly focused in. Uh. I'm seeing 2020 visions yeah. Daily manifesting on my premonitions yeah. Best to keep it neutral, got my own religion yeah. The brainwash, gotta make your own decision My word is James Bond, I stay on the mission Coming for the top position, ain't no competition, man Pull up in the top, it's missing, Put the opposition in All that lane switching, this is what the game is in It's the young, incredible, honest, the unforgettable You were Joe like Chappelle, show this this so perennial, do this for my millennials, I be murdering any flow, I just had to let you know, it's the young, incredible, honest, the unforgettable, you were Joe like Chappelle show, this so perennial, do this for my millennials, I be murdering any flow, I just had to let you know. Surround me, I'm corrupted, flow cold in the 
it's rugged bumpy. What is up? I'm ready for all you got to love it. Like, black, yeah, in the feel like, yeah, all day like, yeah, all night like, yeah, whole squad like, what? In the feel like, yeah, all day like, yeah, all night like, what? Whole squad like, yeah, in the feel like, yeah, all day like, yeah, all night like, yeah, whole squad like. Check the wrist, man. Got him hot. Hey, man, can't ball like this, man. Lord, pass the pig scam. When he stretch a distance, I'm talking a few hundred thousand yards. You just on your fifth grand. Run it up, 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 count it up. Hey, hundreds and fifties and twenties, no fives and no singles, don't count on them. Hey, she wanted like me because I blame she can't count on him. She try to be nosy and hit up my ex. She like, girl, you can count on him. Hey, hey, we need more. Tell him we need more. Putting numbers on the board like I'm keeping score. Hey, 16 cars in my front yard. Hey, 30 on my wrist, what a point to God. Big numbers, big numbers. 100 million bag, that's a big number. Big numbers, big numbers. Whole team got it, that's a big number. Big numbers, big numbers. 100 million bag, that's a big number. Up, it's magic with the gang we ball out it can't get tragic all we got we gon' let you let you have it stuck in my ways think i need to change my habits what would you do if you were me and didn't have look in the mirror now i'm feeling like a savage tell my son i love him for him i'ma make it happen now my dreams reality not going back to back to back to. you say that you proud of me i turn my back you laughing now i hit the scene they like lights camera action living in a dream now my music they be blasting step out i'm a star always in the latest fashion had to set the bar bar try to catch me lacking bank account for my son he won't have to struggle you can see it in my eyes all i do is hustle they tried to knock me off my feet i'm ready to rumble felt like i ain't eight in weeks working off the muscle oh yeah oh my we ride for my brothers no lie all you all you can yeah, we in it for life. life. And I've been up, it's magic. With the gang, we ball out, it can't get tragic. All we 
got, we gon' let you, let you have it. Stuck in my ways, think I need to change my habits. What would you do if you were me and didn't have it? Look in the mirror, now I'm feeling like a savage. Tell my son I love him for him, I'ma make it happen. Now my dream's reality, not going back to back to back. You say that you proud of me, I turn my back, you laugh. Hey, how could you lie to my face? People claim that they be loyal, they be taking up space. See my Roski lose his heart when he was fighting that case. Took so many yells, I'm not going back to those days. I'ma treat you how you treat me, do you like how it tastes? Shawty use a use of can't treat you like my ace. I got way too many problems to be worried, I'm straight. Me and Craig, Craig had to watch for the jakes on the road this road crazy i get 80 a show say my money stack it up and look like i'm like i'm like foreign cars driving fast i never done this before get get on out my problems let me let me when i've been up is magic with the gang we ball out it can't get tragic all we got we gonna let you let you have it stuck in my ways think i need to change my habits what would you do if you were me and didn't have it? look in the mirror now Tell my son I love him for him, I'ma make it happen Now my dream's reality, not going back to back to back You say that you proud of me, I turn my back, you laughing Coach, the Carolina Reigns have arrived as we are inside a soggy Bank of America stadium in Charlotte. Just a few moments ago, this building was shaking as the Carolina Panthers emerge from the tunnel here in Charlotte. They are ready to go as the Panthers are set to match up with Matt Ryan and the Atlanta Falcons. The NFL season has hit high gear, and off we go in Week 11 on EA Sports. This will be taken in at the one. And he will be marked down right there at the 20-yard line. Flies in to blow that play up. The sack cost him only a yard. It's second and 11. Here's New. They'll set up the screen to McCaffrey. And he will lose yardage on the play. Back at his own 19-yard line. Now whistles here, and it looks like we've got a Panther that's having some difficulty down there getting up. While the training staff works on him, we'll step aside and be right back. A little trouble thus far on their opening drive as they come up on a third and 11. A shotgun snap for Newton. 
And he will not be able to hang on through the contact. It's incomplete. The coverage strong, and now it's fourth down. So the defense able to get off the field here on third down. And it's one of the goals of the game. They've got to be effective on passing downs. It's one of the few things defenses chart. How did we do on third down? That's a nice start for them in this one. Line of scrimmage, the 31 now on first and 10. A carry for Devontae Freeman, who missed most of last season. And oh, right away, he lost the football. And it's picked up by the Panthers. And his crew will take over with a football at the 35-yard line. This is David Johnson, the former All-Pro. And he'll be taken down at the 34. Up from his linebacker spot, Deion Jones making the play. Well, we saw him there trying to get it to the outside, trying to get to the perimeter, but not a whole lot of room there. But there's got to be one positive to that. If you keep moving laterally, creases tend to develop as the game moves on, and they can run it back inside later. Great, great, great! On second and nine, Newton flushed out right. That'll be caught by his tight end, Ian Thomas. And all the way inside the 15 before they drop him. That one a gain of 20 in a first down. Ian Thomas got pressed into action early his rookie season as all-pro tight end Greg Olson went down with an injury. Ended up with 36 catches, and they definitely see him as the future once Olson decides to hang it up and maybe become a broadcaster. The first red zone opportunity for the Panthers thus far. It's first and 10 at the 14. On the ground, this is Johnson. Johnson adds poke three, football's out. And the Falcons grab it. And a big turnover there as his guys will get the football back. All these years we've been watching the game, I start to get the sense that whenever it rains out, those guys who have to touch the ball and carry it, they're extremely resentful about that weather. Yeah, I'm just happy I'm not resentful that we have a roof over our heads. I know that much. Yeah, maybe we won't fumble our play sheets here as we just saw the fumble happen on the field. The drive will start with a carry by Devontae Freeman. And he's going to be taken down shy of the 10 right around the 9-yard line. Mario Addison in on the stop. They tried a quick hitter inside, but that one was swallowed up because what they're hoping, those big defensive linemen will take the bait and move laterally and open up a crease that they can run through. Didn't happen on that play. From the nine, here's second and nine. Throw right side caught by Ridley. And he's able to get this one all the way past the 30. And now we'll get a stoppage here. There appears to be an injured Falcon on the field. While the trainers take a look, we'll step aside. From the 32 now, here's first and 10. This is Freeman on first and 10. Dontari Poe in on the stop. They tried a quick hitter inside, but that one was swallowed up because what they're hoping, those big defensive linemen will take the bait and move laterally and open up a crease that they can run through. Didn't happen on that play. 
The last run got a couple. Here's second and eight. 20, 20. Christian Travis. Now it's Ryan. He completes it to Julio Jones. First catch for the NFL's leader in receiving yards a year ago and a first down. I don't care who you put on him, he's going to be a handful in one-on-one -on -one throws. Yeah, right now, you're right. They're in man-to-man, -man, maybe need some safety help. I would say that'd be a good idea. Double-team him somehow. I'm going to have to make someone else beat me rather than let him shred my defense. Now a fake on the give here as they try to run pass option. It's hauled in by Hardy. Too far downfield, something those linemen have to watch out for, and that time it costs them. Ready, blue 80, blue 80. 55, Mike. Watch the turn, watch the 58. All right, 25 to 9. A fake to Freeman. Now it's Ryan. He's airing it out for Samu. And that is going to be pulled in one-handed. Wow. That one goes for 30 yards. A one-handed catch, that's one thing. But with a defender right there, that was a heck of a play. It used to be that one-handed catch was instinctive in a game. Now it's a practiced move. They work on it before, after, during practice sessions. It becomes part of their repertoire, and it pays off. So from Panther territory now, it's first and 10 at the 25-yard line. Back to the running game, it's Freeman. And he'll keep it moving down to the 15-yard line. Nine yards is the pick up there, and they'll have a second and one. And Falcons fans everywhere excited that Devontae Freeman is back on the field wearing number 24 in the red and black. Remember, he went down in week two in 2018 with an injury and didn't return. They're hoping to see the form that led him to 1,000-yard seasons in 2015 and 2016. Second down, Freeman. And he is met quickly in the backfield. Down he goes, folded like a lawn chair. He'll wind up losing a yard on the play, and that's going to lead to a third down. Incomplete. Not only was the call spot on, how about the execution of that defense right there? Zone was absolutely locked up tight. He was trying to force it in there on third down. But if there's a time to force it, he felt like he needed to make a play, right? Yeah, exactly right. Third down, you got to try and find something. There's nothing available there for him. And this one is no good. And this will remain a scoreless game. Well, that hollow metal sound is the bane of any kicker's existence. And here, that sound is going to keep our game scoreless. And you can see him give that body English as the ball was in the air. Come on, baby. Come on. But no dice that time. The offense now at the line, ready for their next drive. And, you know, certainly a lot of football left to be played. We're not into December yet. But right now where we stand, they're first place in their division. Looking good, looking to be a threat come January. And let's think about what every team has in their goals, all right? Number one goal is what? Make the playoffs. Number two goal is win your division. Number three goal, and the biggest goal, I think, is to be the highest seed possible that you can be heading into the playoffs so that you can have as many home games as possible to try and get you to the Super Bowl. And right now fighting for everyone possible to try to at least secure home field for the wild card and or divisional round. They'll say no gain on the play there, and now it'll be third down. Brings up third down and five. Mike. 
We're scoreless after one. Second quarter now from Charlotte, and it's the Panthers with the football. They've got a third down and five to start things out. Out of the gun, Newton. And that's caught by Smith. And he goes out of bounds just shy of the 45. His first catch, and it's a pretty big one. They get the conversion on third down. see a team turn it over on back-to-back -back drives, fumbles on their last two, I know one person's blood pressure who is starting to rise, and that's the head coach. Absolutely. And when's it going to go down? When they stop fumbling? <laughs> <laughs> when they stop fumbling. after he's assessed the game film and only if they manage to win the game. The offense back out there at the line, ready for their next drive. And Charles, if the season ended today, and it's not going to, we still have December yeah, left. More football. <laughs> We're only in November. Uh, but they would be a wild card team, and that's great. They'd be in the playoffs, but you know they're trying to bump up to be one of those division leaders. That guarantees you at least one home game in the playoffs, and that's what you're really seeking. But there also isn't much margin for error for this team, right? Because right where they're sitting, well, a two-game losing streak could have them out of the playoffs, so they've got to make sure they continue to keep the momentum going. Absolutely. There's some sharks smelling blood in the water behind them. Mike, Mike, check, check. 59. They'll throw on first down with Ryan. And it's hauled in by Austin Hooper. And they'll get this one down to about the 20-yard line. Another strong gain on the last two plays. They've moved it a combined 33 yards. First down, I know exactly what's going to be said about that play from the defensive perspective. What's that? That's why I tell all you guys we need more than one tackler to the ball. He broke the first tackle. Luckily enough, there are more people there to get him down. And he'll get it here to the 10-yard line. 10 yards on the pickup there, and it'll be second down. It's second and inches at the 10-yard line. They still need about the length of the football here, maybe a little less as they come up on second and inches. Now Ryan going to give it to Freeman. And he'll be brought down here at the three-yard line. Seven yards there and a first down. They're making it look easy out there. Another first down. So, so far on this drive, let me do this little bit of math here. Four plays, three first downs. That's a pretty good recipe for success. Devontae Freeman 
his fourth touchdown on the year as his guys are first onto the scoreboard here this afternoon. On for the extra point, Giorgio Tavecchio. It's good, and that gives the Falcons a 7 to nothing lead. Makes the score, Falcons 7, Panthers nothing. Now after the touchdown, it's Bosher to kick it away. That's fielded in the end zone. And he'll take it back to about the 19-yard line. This Carolina offense at the line, ready to go. It hasn't gone particularly well for them. That's obvious. In these conditions, no points so far. They've got to get that offense on track. The question, how do they do it? It is the age-old question, isn't it? And to me, finding a way to make sure your playmakers touch the ball without it being too exotic, meaning you don't have to go deep down the field. Maybe you hit them on those short passes on the perimeter. Make sure you just turn around and hand it to your best runner and get out of the way. Don't Jeff, cause any Jeff, extra stress on your Jeff, offense. Jeff, well, the first play of the drive <laughs> lost four. Now they'll look to move it forward here on second and 14. Escaping the pressure right. Cam fighting. He lost the football. It's out. And the Falcons say they have it. They do. And now three drives, three fumbles. What's amazing about it is when we go around and watch practices, how many times do we see them put that sleeve over a football now to make it more slippery and hard to handle? It's almost like they're playing with that sleeve on the ball right now. Was that three drives? Yep. Three fumbles? Three fumbles. It's time to change our luck some way, somehow. Focus, concentration, you'll hear those words on the bench in a big way right now. The loss of a full three yards, and now it's second down. Now on second and 13, Ryan getting it out left side to Sanu. And he'll be brought down inside the 20 at the 19. Four yards on the completion, and it sets up a third down. Well, if you do read man coverage, Brandon, the drag route's a pretty good one to run against it because you're running away from people on it. Ready, Blue 80! Blue 80! Get that quarterback, D-line! Get that quarterback! Get that quarterback! Ready, On third down, Ryan. It's caught! Jones! And they've got it inside the 10 at the 8. They're able to convert on third down, and that sets up a first and goal. Nice catch right there. Brings to mind the sentence, when in doubt, find your veterans. He used to laugh back in the day when they would call guys like him crafty veterans. You, know, you get up in your 30s, you're still playing receiver, but you're around that long at that position, you're doing something right. Just remember this. When he was young, he thought the crafty veteran was simply a guy who couldn't run anymore. Now he understands a little bit better. Coming up at halftime, we'll join Jonathan Coachman and the gang in Orlando. Coach will have stats and scores from the early games going on here around the NFL. And he's brought down right at the five-yard line. Give him two on the play. He'll get two out of that run, and it's going to bring up a second and goal. And the ball smack dab on the five-yard line. Here's second and goal. To throw is Ryan. Flush to his right. Touchdown, Falcons. 
Well, this was a pass all the way, but he just kept buying time, didn't he? It was kind of like, wait, wait. Oh, it's open. Time to hop foot it and go. And boy, was he successful. Yeah, didn't go to the outside toward the pylon, just straight ahead, middle third of the field. Shortest distance between two points. Straight line. Footing always a concern, but the extra points up and good. And that'll make the score 14 to zip. Now after the touchdown, it's Bosher to kick it away. That's fielded in the end zone. Boy, shifts past him. And the decision to bring it out is going to cost him about seven yards, all told, as he's taken down back shy of the 20. The Panthers out there and ready to begin their next drive. Already down two touchdowns here in the first half. This becomes a pretty important drive, doesn't it? It certainly does, and a lot of the teams scrape. Cam fighting. He lost the football. It's out. On plays like this where the ball comes free, it's often unusual for the team that lost it to get it back because this is, this is the quarterback. The ball gets away from him. Everyone else is trying to execute what they're supposed to do on offense. They're usually looking in the other direction, downfield, or have moved away from him. In this case, though, a teammate is able to come up with the ball. Now then, after the sack, it'll be interesting to see what they have planned for second and 23. To throw is Newton. He's going to want into heavy traffic, and it's intercepted. Picked up by Keanu Neal, and he'll take this back down inside the 20. You're trailing, you're trying to get points late in half. I absolutely understand that. But remember, it's all about the ball. And without the ball, you can't get those points. They just turned it over. Now you got to be careful because that deficit can get a little bigger on the other side with that good field position they just took over with. On first down, Freeman. And they got it inside the 10 at the 8. It's a good gain of 11. Sets him up first and goal. Tremendous blocking by the interior of the offensive line. They didn't just gash him there. They blasted a gaping hole for him to gallop through. I think if he comes back to the huddle, he better be giving them a whole lot of credit and thanking them for that much space to rumble. Here's first and goal. And gosh, points here. A chance maybe to put this thing away before halftime. They'll run here with Freeman. And running room scarce here. He's going to be stopped in his tracks at the line of scrimmage. No gain on the play that time, and it sets up second and goal. Now the Falcons going to use one of their timeouts as the clock will stop with 18 seconds to go in the first half. Nothing on first down, so the ball remains at the eight-yard line, second and goal. You got nothing. Hey, South. Ryan on the handoff. It's Freeman. And he will maneuver his way down to about the seven. The second down play, not much better than the first. Just a gain of one there. Now a timeout signaled for, and they'll get it with 10 seconds to go before halftime. In their mind, certainly a field goal try would be a letdown. They had the great starting field position, now facing third down. Here's Ryan to throw. And he's got his star receiver. It's Jones for the Falcon touchdown. Julio Jones. In the final seconds of the first half, and the Falcons push further out in front to Vecchio to add the PAT. And it is now 21 to nothing. Next 
Now after the touchdown, it's Bosher to kick it away. That'll be taken in the end zone. And he will be brought down here at about the 17-yard line. And this should be the final play before the quarter ends. Let's set a tone, fellas. Let's set a tone. A final shot before the break. Newton steps away to his left. And he's going to get this one across the 30-yard line. We have hit halftime. Still two more quarters to go. We'll take a timeout. We'll be back after this. You're watching the NFL, and it's on EA Sports. It's in the game. Forecast calling for more of the same. The rain set to continue as we are underway in the second half. This will be taken to the back of the end zone. And no run back here. This will be a touchback, and it comes out to the 25-yard line. About set to begin their next drive. The Falcons offense at the line. They built a good first half lead. Now they have a chance to add on to it. And what I'm thinking is that the offensive staff spent the entire halftime just working with them on, here's what we think they're going to do to attack us in the second half. Nice first half that we've had, guys. But be prepared for some change-ups. We're going to see them when we kick it off in the second half. See how they handle any adjustments that might be made defensively. The drive starting play, a good one. Give him 19. First down, Falcon. Took just one play to move all the way to the 44 as they try again on first down. 61, matchbox lights. Mike 52, Mike 52. Come on, baby, come on, let's go. Now it's Freeman. Try to find a lane, but instead he'll get back to the line of scrimmage. And no more. No gain on the play there. Second down. No gain on the play. They've called his number a lot this afternoon. You wonder how much tread is left on those tires. We certainly do, but I always think back to one of my favorite coaches in the NFL, and he used to have a meeting with his running backs every year in the offseason and say, look, as many times as you're going to carry the ball, you should be able to carry it one more time, so make sure you get in shape. No gain on the play there, so that doesn't help. Now they're looking up at a third and nine situation. is brought in by Hardy. And they're going to have another first down as the tackle's made at the Panthers' 30. A gain of 26 yards. And the Falcon first down. So first and 10 now from the 30. Now Freeman, he's been busy today. Two yards on the carry there. It'll be second down. I know the scouting report on him is that he doesn't possess the eye discipline to be an elite linebacker. What that means is his ability to read, react, and make a play. But on that one, he looked like one of those guys. Throwing on second and eight. Ryan, they'll set up the screen for Freeman. And he went nowhere. Well, he went backwards. Back to the 33. 
That'll go as a loss of five. And it'll be a third and about 13. Shotgun, Ryan. Flushed out right. He may try and run for this. And he'll avoid the tackle there with a slide. And they're going to have another first down as the tackle's made at the Panthers' 15-yard line. When they watch film of this game and hand out the grade sheets, he's going to really like getting a double plus on this play. Why? He scrambles and picks up a first down. But what else does he do? Protects himself by sliding and avoiding the big hit. Double plus, big time play. They'll run on first down. It's Freeman, and they'll lose yardage here. Knocked back to the 19 yard line. That's going to wind up a loss of a full three yards on first down. That loss of three, a rare stumble on a promising drive. Here's second and 13. Ryan. Pressure comes in. He's brought down. It's a Panther sack. K1 short. He's the one to get him, and that is sack number seven for him on the year. So the sack pushes him back, and now third and long for Ryan and the Falcons. Hey, express, express! 52 to Mark. Gun, gun, gun! On your mind, get the gun! Out of the gun, it's Ryan. Looking for the end zone. And it's incomplete, almost intercepted. He had a great shot of picking that off in the end zone. It brings up fourth down. So out comes the field goal team now for the second time here today. This from 44 yards out, left hash. The kick by Tavecchio is good. And that stretches this lead even further. It's now 24 to nothing. So he missed that field goal earlier, but he says not this time. Able to knock it through, give his guys three. I like his poise. I like his confidence, his belief in himself. Sometimes when you miss that first one, you see a lot of guys sag, and they can't make the next one. Not in this case. Stepped right up like a pro. And he's up across the 25 and down at the 28-yard line. The offense now at the line, ready for their next drive. And here we are almost through three quarters of play, and this passing game still has not really found any kind of rhythm. Put it mildly, because they're not even over 100 yards yet. And in today's NFL, where it's a pass-first league, that is quite surprising. Not many teams patient enough to stick with the run. Everybody wants to advance the ball through the air. They've got to get their timing back. From the 31. Newton, eluding the pressure right. And he gets this to the 35. Good for a gain of five. They brought the blitz that time, and I thought they were going to get to him, but instead, he flipped it on its ear and ended up picking up positive yardage. I thought he was dead to rights, but you are exactly correct, sir. Able to turn that into a positive game. This offense in desperate need of a conversion as they come up on third down. Go, go. They'll try and run for it. Here's Johnson. And he will have a first down here at about the 40. 
It's a gain of four there, and it gives him a new set of downs. That's good for the Panthers. First down. And that is going to do it for this third quarter of action. We'll return with more after this break. You're watching the NFL on EA Sports. They stay on the ground on first for Johnson. And they're going to get him behind the line yet again as his nightmare afternoon continues. That's going to go as a loss of one on first down. They give to Johnson going right. And this has been a familiar sight all afternoon as they stop him behind the line. It's a loss of two, now third down. We think, Brandon, I like the intensity of this defense is showing right here in these first few drives. They're not just holding the line because they're doing their job, but they're doing more than that, aren't they? They're getting a nice push into the offensive backfield. And a great example right there for the loss on the tackle. Check the backer, check the backer. Great, great, great. Third and long, it's Newton. He can run for it, and he will. Finding some room at midfield. And he's got it across the 50 to the 47-yard line. Newton able to use those legs and get past the marker to pick up the first. So an instance there of Cam being Cam. We know he can use his legs. And with that big body, it's hard to get him down, even if you get a clear shot on him. Plus, he moves it a lot faster than what people think. And boy, does he have fun playing the game of football. Now Newton on first down. And the Falcons get there. The Falcons get the sack. Down he goes. Don't need it all back at once, but you figure they're going to need something here. 17 yards to go on second down. Escaping the pressure right. And he's able to take it across midfield before going out of bounds. He turned that into a nice gain. Gets him eight yards closer for third down. Well, he's proven real effective running the football. No one open. Don't force it. Just get what you can. And that's what he's done very well in this game. Here comes the eighth play of the drive, and they need a full 10 yards on third down. Check 50, check 50, 20. From the gun, here's Newton. And they get to Newton and take him down for the sack. Adrian Claiborne able to record his fifth sack of the season. We've been around this league for a while, and many coaches never pull their starting quarterback, almost no matter the situation. In this case, though, I think he's got to make a decision. He's taking a pretty good beating out there. Yeah, with the deficit, maybe not wanting to risk an injury. Now Newton. And the pressure gets to him again. Tech McKinley. And the Falcons will take control of the football in great field position. Line of scrimmage, the 37 on first and 10. A 20th carry now for Devontae Freeman. Trying to run inside, but nothing there. Luke Keekley, the all-pro linebacker, in on the stop. But well, we just saw a great example of what we talked about with his coach prior to the game. He's definitely one of the better linebackers at reading a play and flowing to make the stop before it turns into something big. Throwing on second down, Ryan. Nowhere to escape, and he goes down. Mario Addison in there to get him, and that is sack number six now for him on the year. Well, there was second long, now it's third and even longer. They're going in the wrong direction here. Because they're moving exactly the way they want to, but you're exactly right. Definitely going in the wrong direction for the offensive guys. Third and long, it's Ryan. Now they go screen, it's complete. And he'll lose yardage here, back at the 47. A loss of a yard and it brings up fourth. I love the intelligence the defense just showed there. Read their keys, saw the screen developing, ran to it and smothered it. What a third down stop by them.
And he was called on three times in the win last week as his first one here's away. The offense back out there at the line, ready for their next drive. And let's face it, this drive is not going to have any bearing on this game, but it's kind of important for one reason, isn't it? It certainly is. You got to get points. And okay, all right, I'm being facetious here. But you get points, you feel a little bit better about yourself as you move on to the next one. Another incompletion. You know, it's a wonder he's still moving around back there the number of times he's been sacked. Yeah, he's staying out there, isn't he? And you don't think about it much in a game like this, but he's showing incredible leadership. Still can Competing, still fighting, not taking himself out of a ball game that appears lost. And he's taken down, but not before he gets this across the 25-yard line. 11 yards there, first down. First and 10 at the 28-yard line. Ready, McKinney. Just two minutes remaining here in the fourth quarter of what has been a one-sided affair. So it's Panther football as we welcome you back. They've got a first and ten as they search for a late score. Newton now to throw. Oh, he dropped it. And that's pretty indicative of the way this one's gone. Well, the trials and tribulations of being a quarterback in this league, it's tough. It's got to be wearing on him out there. Well, he has been sacked a number of times. He had an interception, so I'm going to give him a skosh of credit for hanging in there and trying to make something happen, despite the amount of pressure he's been under this entire game. On second and ten. Newton, screenplay, Johnson. Touchdown, Carolina! David Johnson, his ninth touchdown of the season. And the Panthers are able to cut into this lead. So they will get on the scoreboard here. Give them credit for that. Too little, too late, but no zero. Are you... <laughs> You're going slow clap on me. <laughs> Not very nice, is it? No, but they haven't been very nice on offense. It's been a struggle. Extra point try good by Gano. And that'll make it 24-7. to Gano now following the touchdown here to kick it away. This is fielded a couple yards deep. And he'll get it up past the 20 to the 22 yard line. About set to begin their next drive. The Falcons offense at the line. And a few kneel downs should just about do it. Now defensively they do have all three timeouts. But very little reason to use them at this point. They'll run with Freeman here to begin the drive. Give him a couple on the carry there. Second and eight. That's it. That's what you want. Straight ahead positive gain. Just keep that clock ticking. The last run good for two. Here's second and eight. Freeman again. And he'll get it up to the 33-yard line. Nine yards to pick up there, and it's a first down. Uh, he's still rumbling, isn't he? Still looking fresh in this one despite the heavy workload. But you and I both know, well-conditioned, and he did tell us that he thrives on being at his peak late in ball games. On the heels of that good carry by Devontae Freeman, here's first and ten. Now a handoff here to his running back. Just a yard on the pickup there, and it'll bring up a second and nine. 
Nice job by the defensive front there to hold him to a short gain on first down. Well played, I must say. Yeah, only getting one yard. There was no room to run. And he'll be limited to a short gain up to about the 34-yard line. And now with four seconds left, we get a timeout call. The Falcons on third down. They've hit four of seven. This is third and nine. Mike, Mike, check, check. They toss to Freeman. And he'll be taken down well before the first at about the 36-yard line. So time runs out. It's a victory for the Atlanta Falcons. And it was their defense that really paved the way to this victory as they allowed the one touchdown, and that was all she wrote. Almost want to do the defense chant right now, right? Defense with a couple of claps in there, but no one wants to hear that from me. Let's just talk about how they got it done, though. When you take care of every aspect of the game, shut down the run, control the airways, right? Make sure the quarterback is harassed. This is the type of performance you get. They can't fashion together any offense, no consistency, and they just took control. So for Atlanta, they continue to put themselves in position for a first round bye as they move to eight and two, and they will head back home next week. Meanwhile, for the Panthers, they come back to the pack a bit as their record falls to seven and three. And they'll try to turn things around next week as they have a matchup in New Orleans against the Saints. That'll do it for us. I'm Brandon Gordon, alongside Charles Davis. Thanks to our entire crew as well. We'll talk to you next time. So long, everybody.